Yo, what is going on GG fam, it's your boy back with another video and today we have got a very very exciting video. There has been some waves, there has been some waves been made in the airsoft community by the names of Lycan Tactical. He's been making some absolute waves, basically the guy has never shot a real steel firearm before in his life. T-Rex are basically sponsored him to go to America and he shoots at a range for the first time with a the first time ever shooting a real steel firearm and once he gets to grips with it he absolutely dominates it's very impressive um i'll comment on the video and what i think once we get into it but before we get to that you know i need to give my gg mvp shout this is for everyone who's subscribed if hit the bell notification and they're inside the geese guys so which is my discord for everyone who's into military who's serving soldiers ex-serving soldiers airsoft there's everyone that just loves guns is in there so my gg mvp shout out goes to vet major brody congratulations mate so if you want a shout out like that you know what to do so like i said this guy's been making absolute waves on the internet uh, i've been very impressed i really i'm really really impressed with t-rex arms as well how they've treated this guy they've flown him over their content that they make is amazing it's just it's a very positive very great video and it also proves a lot of people wrong so Without further ado, let me get me a phone in. Oh, by the way, guys, uh, my name's Nico. I was in the British Army for five years. Now I make uh, airsoft content and military reaction videos. We just like to look at units of guns, etc., etc., etc. So this is very, this is very up our street. So roll the clip. Alright, let's read that. In June 2019, 38 freedom-loving Americans pulled their money to fund a young Jap Japanese airsofter's dream. Sick. We love that. We love that. I love how smiley he is. Oh, let's pause it. This is the story of Liko's first, Liku's first time shooting a real firearms. Let's get it. Okay. Americans win. Guys, Lucas here, and I'm here with one That's of our awesome. projects that we've been I've not seen this before. I've been Japan. told to watch it. This is Liku. He's Aimbot 1.0. Aimbot 1.0. Update today and see what's going on. Awesome. The thing uh, that I see a lot of guys talking about with airsoft is airsoft will never benefit shooting. While well, Liku here has been doing airsoft now for years. So narrow-minded. Every single shooter here at the range. So we're Let's get that on silent. Can an airsofter who's never fired a real gun because Liku's from Japan, where he can't own real firearms. Can he get onto a real firearm, a Glock 19, and my BCM, and slay drills having only done airsoft? And that's what we're going to find out today. And of course he will. Once he gets the all figured out, some of the trigger stuff figured out, he's going to blaze it down. Yeah. So you guys want to see this? Yeah. Ready? All right. Yeah. Left circle. 2.10. Right. I just want to say, this guy looks slick as fuck, don't he? Just, he looks... Dangerous. All right. That's your turn. Six rounds into that circle. Are you ready? They're even dressed the same. <laughs> this is his first time ever shooting a handgun. Are you ready? Ready. Stand by. Can I just say, straight away, they're not telling him how to load. He, his, um, his movement is already there. His motor skills are already there. It's all fluid. And he's an airsoft player, never shot a real gun. Oh, malfunction, cock it. Boom. He knows. Obviously, that's the first time with a recoil. And that's a, were you, you were aiming for this? Left. Yes. So what's happening is all you're doing is you're driving the gun down, so we're going to fix that. So come with me. You stand right here. I like this guy. I like this guy. I don't know him. It's the first time watching him. I just like him. Aim for the small circle. <clears throat> he looks like a good teacher. Just take the gun out. Just have it out. And you see how the trigger here has a wall? I want you to go to the wall, and then you will fire that shot. So aim at the small circle. Small circle. Yep, go to the wall. Okay. okay. See where the wall is? All right. So we'll put this side to that small circle. You can tell he does this a lot. A lot of coaching. Look at him. You can tell. From the wall. 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 From the wall. Slow. I need training with a Glock, man, with pistol work. I'd love to do this. 
I've not shot a real firearms in ages now since I left the army. A bit sad about that actually. Wall. From the wall. Wall. It's good fun. Good. Yes. On the wall. Good. On the wall. Good. Let's tighten up a little bit. Let's, let's get on the gun. Reload. Good. Alright, suit again. Let's try. Bye. Good. Rapid. Rapid. 3.40. This is Liku's first time shooting a handgun. We've gotten some of that anticipation out of the way. What a lot of people aren't paying attention to is, look how quick that gun is back in his holster. When he said reload, drops the mag out, doesn't even think twice about it, drops the mag out, fresh mag in. Once he's done, back into his chest, straight into the holster, without even looking. Like, this isn't, people, people may be overlooking this, but that's like slick as fuck. Do you know what I mean? It's impressive. And this is all because of Airsoft. The fact that Airsoft gets hate because oh, it's a pussy, it's your train to pretend to blah, 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 blah. The fact of the matter is, is these kids, these people, are running dry, dr dry, this is really hard to say, dry drills all the time. Practicing all the time, motor skills, movements, changing mags, you know, putting yourself in that environment with that kit that's ex exactly the same as the real kit, bar certain characteristics as, as in the recoil, etc, etc. So this kid is just like fucking karate kid mate, wax on, wax off, at his range in Japan, getting amongst it, daily. Of course he's gonna be slick as fuck at this, like, you're gonna be stupid if you think this guy's not gonna be good at real steel shooting. Once he gets over the characteristics of the gun, he's gonna be full send. Now he's gonna burn it down. <laughs> Alright. Look how quick he gets it out of that holster. There you go, Luke. But he's not, he's not even looking, bro. In. That's how much he does this, that he can get that gun back into that holster that quick. I can't do that. I miss my holster all the time. That's difficult, you know. <laughs> Every time it's back in the holster. How many times have you guys played airsoft and you've hit the side of your holster trying to get your pistol back in? That's just practice. That is pure practice, that. Repetition. Wax on, wax off. Good. Stand by. Stand by. Look at his face. Look at his face. So now, we'll do more. Wow, he's like a, he's almost robotic, isn't he? That's impressive, man. I'd love a go of this. So now it's almost like that pistol has no recoil. Move. That's got to be all like, technique, all technique. Of arms, and he legitimately understood how to clear malfunctions, why he was clearing them, the safety was. Right. So what I've done is I've just edited out some of like the kind of slow parts and just put in all the juicy bits. So next, it's what he's like with a rifle. Okay. That was something that really spoke a uh, testimony to dry fire um, and airsoft as a training aid. Right. It is a training aid. I don't, <laughs> I don't understand people beef of airsoft because it is 100% a training aid. It's like, you, you, what more proof do you need? Like, you're using all the kit that is used in wars, you're using all the same platforms, some actual real rifles that have just put, had airsoft parts put in them, you're still changing mags on the move, you, you've still got to identify targets, take them out, make like super fast risk assessments in your head, move forward, move backwards. Uh, take command of your battle space, all this kind of stuff you do you do in real life, so of course it's a training aid. Simple as that. And this guy is the proof in the pudding. Comfortable he is. Okay, a bit of recoil there. A bit. Let's do it again. Six but it's his first time. So as you can see, the gun is kind of coming up. Yep. And all you're going to do is you're going to pull it back. Bang, pull back. But look how he's holding the rifle Bang, when he's not shooting. Look at that, second time around, way better. Much better. And look at his mannerism. Safety on, plus his dust cover up. Weapon back into like a safe position. No one's telling him to do this. Do you know what I mean? No one's telling this guy to do this. It's fucking beautiful. I fucking love it. Let's do it again. It's 284. Let's do it again. Six rounds. 
You can tell it's mannerisms, it's mannerisms. Safety cap pull right, in. Do it again. We can go faster. It's a 209. 209. 172. Alright, so that's his. First time, I think he's got it. I think he's got it figured out. All right, let's do one round. 87. Do it again. Stand by. Okay, you can do faster than that. 67. Stand by. 64. Stand by. 52. Stand by. <laughs> Lovely. Stand by. Brilliant. Brilliant. Four, four. Four, four. Look at his face. Stand by. <laughs> Fantastic. Oh, malfunction. Luke, Luke, no one's telling him to do All this. Right. Let's, uh, let's do it again. Not only did he clear a malfunction and he's back in and he's hit the target, but I just love the way safety on dust cover up. Like, it's a mannerism. You can tell that that's been, he's drilled it into himself, mate. Practice makes perfect. Stand by. It's a three nine. Stand by. <laughs> what a geezer! Right, I love this guy. Four zero. Stand by. That was quick. Right. That was quick. So my standard for a headshot usually at about five yards under half a second. He's doing this in three six, and he's never shot a rifle before. Oh, it's so amazing. To all of you who don't dry fire, who say dry fire is, doesn't do anything for you. This kid who's never shot. Just ignorance, wife, man. Is out shooting 99.99% .99 of FUDs on the internet and here in America. And he's not even from America, he's from Japan. All right, let's see this. Stand by. Beautiful. Beautiful. Look at that. In. Cocked. Oh. Oh, fucking hell, he's like Zorro with that thing, bro. That was beautiful. That was beautiful. Still better than all of you. Yeah. <laughs> all right, let's do it again. Here. Practice. Right, stand by. Zero. Oh, wait, let me ask. Oh, cock. Cock. So you're hitting, yeah, in. You're hitting this he's a just, little too soon. Yeah. Yes, two He's just hitting his magwa, man. And then hit it. Then hit it. Yep. It's a little too Then hit the bolt release, then you're in. Thought time. But see, he's not going to know this because he uses an airsoft gun. So not only he's learning on the spot right now in front of cameras, what he's got on his side is hideous amounts of time and practice. Going through the dry drills, going through the mannerisms, going through the motor skills, it's all there. It's all there. All he's got to do is pick up the characteristics of this uh, real steel gun and that's it. He's in. He's locked in. And this just goes to show that fucking throw ego aside, throw ignorance aside, it's very, very obvious that Airsoft is great training aid for uh, real firearms and they should push this into the militaries, they should push this into CQB training. Not only would it make life in the army way more fun, but like your soldiers would be shit up constantly. Here's what I think about that. Here's what he's doing. That's it. There we go. Safety on dust cap up. He's there, mate. He's there. That's a 243. So that's. So he meets the standard of three seconds. Now that he got the bad lever figured out, is at five, seven, ten yards. Doesn't really matter. I love everyone freaking one, out. It's brilliant. Boy, stand by. Oh, crock, cock. There we go. Oh, he's done it again. Oh, <laughs> oh my God! He even busted out the jam. Get it out of there! Yes! Look, like he, he just knows. He just knows, man. He just knows. Oh, that was beautiful. Yes! Right, look at this guy. Look how slick this guy is. I love watching this guy.
Wow. 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 Stand by. He's probably feeling the pressure a little bit. He's probably feeling the pressure a little bit because I've seen him do it quicker than that. Dry fire, it works. It works. Of course it works, bro. It's the same fucking material. It just shoots differently. The reloads oh, don't. You <laughs> recoil will not affect your reloads, will it? Stand by. <laughs> oh, oh. Yes, good, good. Get it in there. That rifle reload, though. Yeah, that rifle reload yes. is rapid. Stand by. Practice, boys. Now we'll just do two, 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 and two. Slow shooting, but fast moving. Can I just say props to this guy? You see, you can just tell he's a great teacher. He's a great teacher. A lot of patience. Seems like a really decent bloke. Come on, man. Magan. Good. Holy cow. All right, let's do it again. Let's do it again. Stand by. I want to go, man. Oh. That wasn't. That wasn't a malfunction. All right. Good. Stand by. Now he's forgot to cock it. Careful. Stand by. All right. Let's go faster. Faster shooting. Bang, 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 bang. Stand by. To think that when he first picked up that rifle, he was like... And now look at him. He, he's fucking zeroed, he's locked in, then targets are getting dealt with, mate. It's beautiful. It's just beautiful. Reload. Oh, he's out of mags. He's out of mags. Pistol, pistol, pistol. Ah! Oh. <sighs> There we go. That pistol never hits the side of that holster. That pistol is in there every single time. That is hideous amounts of hours. Hideous amounts of hours of practice. I don't know. I've got a dry fire for like four hours. Uh, I like this guy, man. He's cool. That was a 181. Good. All right. Center, left, right. Yeah. Programming. He's getting it dialed in. Yeah. This looks fucking fun, man. I want to go. Yeah, yeah, I was like. Stand by. Right now. Six. One. One. Six, one, one. All right. Go for a little speed right here. We'll throw people. Oh, he is. Whew. All right. Stand by. Two. All right. Wow, that's beautiful. Note when he did that then, yeah, <clears throat> he shot and he, the mag came out the rifle as he was, no, he shot and he turned to target and the mag came out just before he went to his new target. So instead of shooting, reloading there and then went, put his mag back in and then turned to that new target. He had shot, he's turned to that target and then reloaded. Kind of like, he's reloaded midway, but he's, as he's come back, his gun's already on. 
That was nice, like that. <laughs> Are you ready? Yes, two or two. Stand by. Two thirty-five. Yes, yeah, so he's Stand reloaded by. a little bit too early. Two eighty. Stand by. Oh, difficult. Two ninety-two. Good job. Good job. Man, now it's all about two. avoiding that magwell. One, same target. Yeah, same target. Stand by. Two eleven. Beautiful. Right. So my end thoughts on this. Yes, airsoft is a great trade aid for shooting weapons, weapon manipulation, weapon motor skills, weapon movements. And if you think it isn't, then you're stupid. <laughs> Peace.